You told me you gon' ride forever We gon' die together You told me you gon' stay with me Through storm and weather You told me you gon' hold it down When I'm not around And you told me if the niggas holler You won't make a sound You told me you gon' ride forever We gon' die together You told me you gon' stay with me Through storm and weather You told me you gon' hold it down When I'm not around And you told me What's up, YouTube? To all the Watlow gang and the new viewers. Stop. That is not how we said we was gonna come in. Introduce yourself how you say you go introduce yourself and I introduce myself how I said I was gonna introduce myself. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy D E What? <laughs> What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Duvon. And it's your girl, Jazz, whatever. Tony. Yeah. That's what it, that's what you. Yes, because I said I was going to this myself, how I was going to this myself every time. So, what are we eating today? So, this mukbang consists of hamburger helper, beef stroganoff. If you ain't eating the stroganoff, honey, you ain't eating the. Every time we eat hamburger helper, it's always it's beef stroganoff. <laughs> I like other type of hamburger helper. You have to say that. Yes, I do. You always be like, no, get the stroganoff. Uh oh. <laughs> you don't be about that. I don't remember that. Every time I eat it, I'm And then we got. Got, and then we got <laughs> but you be tearing it up, though. <laughs> exactly. Um, and we got string beans. Wait a minute, no, I feel. We got string beans with onions and ground beef in it. I did something different. I don't know why. Um, and it's Kool Aid, and I got some water, and I got my crystal hot sauce because I need it for my string beans. <laughs> so, y'all, this, y'all know y'all see the title or whatever. This is actually <clears throat> part two because Devon told his side of the first time he got caught. Cheating. Okay, so this is my first time um, I got caught cheating. This is about to be interesting. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hold on, y'all. Let me get another bite. Mm. So, the first time I got I got caught cheating, um, I actually was living in North Carolina back in 2013 or 14, one or the other, and uh, I think it was 12 or 13, no, I think it was 13 or 14, one or the other, whatever. Um, so, at the time, I was in a long distance relationship with my uh, first boyfriend or whatever. Well, not really my first boyfriend, but y'all get what I'm saying. Uh, I was in North Carolina in a long distance relationship and I kinda was getting aggravated with just being by myself. And on top of that, I really didn't wanna be with him anymore. So I did something very like effed up like real effed up. So there was this girl that I was talking to. I was talking to a couple girls actually at the time. I was talking to like five or six girls. I did not do anything with all five of them. I mean six of them. I only did something with one of them. Okay? So let's clear that up for y'all get to say, oh god damn she home. No, I'm not. Um what is this? An onion uh like the middle of the onion. Um, so at the time I was talking to her, he didn't know I was talking to her. He had just left North Carolina from spending a whole week with me at my dad's house. We was in, um, so when he left, I ended up like linking up with this girl and we actually went out, had a good time. And, um, that day, well, he kept calling me, and whenever he called me, I would never answer the phone. And um, one day, she was, I was at her house, in her bed, and um, I was asleep, and I was kinda like a little, um, 
what's the word? I guess you could say intoxicated. Well, you blame it on the liquor. I was hungover. <laughs> but I was at. I was Over the, what? The headboard? <laughs> um. So I was a little hungover. At this point, I was just so tired of just even being in a relationship with him that I didn't care. And I didn't know how to break up with him or anything. So one day she was there and she kept seeing my phone ringing. She was like, let me answer the phone. And I was like, no, why would you do that? And she was like, because he keep blowing your phone up. Let me talk to him. And I was like, no, no. And then he kept calling because he wanted to see what I was doing and if I was okay or whatever the case may be. And we talked every single day because guess what? We're in a long distance relationship. So. My bad, y'all. The camera died. But I think I was saying, um, she was asking, she was like telling me like, let me answer the phone. And at that time, her room was so big, it was like, everybody was in there. So it was like three other girls in the room we was chilling with, and I was asleep. So I was just like, F it, like, go ahead, answer the phone. She answered the phone and she was like, how may I help you, um, like being funny. Like, she was like, how may I help you, she's asleep right now in my bed. And Lord have mercy. All I remember him saying was, what you mean she in your bed? What you mean? Duh, 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 duh. And literally, everybody in the room was like, every, every time, okay, like after she said that, she hung up. She called back. She answered the phone again. He was like, how many of you? Something, something, something. Then the phone got passed around the whole room to everybody. Um, and the phone got passed around to everybody in the room and it was just being like an ass. And then that's when I basically was just like, um, I basically got caught because then I think he ended up seeing a picture or a video and then it just went from there and that was really it for me. Um, that was my first time I got caught cheating. And we ended up breaking up and everything. Mm -mm. So did you want to go get together? It was my stripper. Oh. Mm. So <clears throat> When you went to the house that night, that was straight from the club? I don't remember if it was straight from the club. I don't remember. I think it was, yeah, it probably was straight from the club. Because I was drunk. Oh, so you were drunk enough to go to the house? Mm-hmm. But you were drunk enough to go home. I don't even remember if I was drunk. I remember being, I had a bad hangover. I think we was having fun or doing something, and that happened. Excuse me. That was my first time I got caught cheating, though. Did y'all do anything that night? Of course you did. Oh, you was already talking to me. I know. Well, that was the first night y'all had. No, that was just one of the nights I got caught up. Oh. I was hanging with her for a while before he. Yeah. Okay, I, was hanging, I was hanging with her like a month. I think. Oh, so y'all already in there? Mm mm. I wasn't. I was already in there. We was just. I, I don't even remember. I think we was talking for like a month or two. But she would come over to my house and everything. <laughs> come pick me up and she'll get off work late and then she'll come pick me up and take me to damn IHOP. Mm. Yeah.
But that was my first time, y'all. I got caught cheating. So, like, comment, subscribe if you want to hear another story time. That was a story time, right? Yeah. That was basically a story time. How long was that? I think it was long. Ago. I think it was like a good 10 minutes. For the first one? No, the first one was like uh, five. Yeah. <laughs> we're talking about time. <laughs> really, time. <laughs> that time means something, y'all. Well, y'all, make sure if y'all ever do a YouTube video, make sure it's over 10 minutes. <laughs> That's another tip. <laughs> Exclusive tip. Mm -hmm. That was good, though. Because if you don't go over the 10 minutes, you can't do a personalized ad. Oh, that's what it is. Okay. So that's a tip for y'all. Mm-hmm. You know, you creators. Whatever you do, make sure your video is over 10 minutes. Mm-hmm. Like she said, make sure y'all share, comment, subscribe. If y'all know our social media, we're going to put our social media down at the bottom. Um, if y'all got any pranks y'all got any things that we should do as far as like story time mukbang um whatever y'all need to dm us snapchat instagram facebook whatever like because we trying to this is our what second video of 2020 mm -hmm. so y'all we gotta get there they gotta help us get there. Mm -hmm. It's all up to you. Yeah, you. I'm well, pointing to you. Share, liking, and comment on the video. But yeah, y'all. That was good. I think I want another scoop. Me too. Uh uh. I want another plate. No, dude. This booty. is the smallest place in the world. That's what I be trying to tell you. You fat. Alright, y'all. I was about to get first. We can out. never have leftovers <laughs> because Devon eat like. A 600 pound person.